I'm Lieutenant Colonel Teresa Pierce, and I'm a preventive medicine physician and the med COE surgeon. I'm here today to help dispel some of the myths that might be out there, whether it's in the news, on the radio, or just when you're talking to friends and family. So the first myth we're gonna talk about is can coronavirus be spread through my HVAC system? That's a natural concern, whether we're thinking of it can be transmitted in our homes, or whether we're concerned that it might be transmitted through the HVAC system in our workplace. And we certainly wanna keep ourselves and our coworkers safe at work too. The short answer to that myth is no, coronavirus can't be transmitted through your HVAC system. So even if you took all those respiratory droplets that come out when you cough or sneeze and projected them right into that air return of your HVAC system, it's still not going to be able to be transmitted by blowing out through the vents throughout the rest of the building. So some of you may have heard about the coronavirus being aerosolized for three hours. This was from a particular study where they used a special machine, an aerosolizer and something called a Goldberg drum. Now this is a scientific machine and this machine is basically created and made just to keep particles suspended in the air. So while in that study, where they had a special humidity and temperature to keep that virus happy inside the drum, it did last for three hours. But the environment inside of that drum is not really the same kind of a situation that you would have in your home or in your office, because we don't have a rotating drum to specially keep all of those particles up in the air. When they come out of our mouth, whether we're sneezing or coughing, they're just gonna to fall to the ground like they normally would. So the best way to keep yourself safe is to wash your hands or use hand sanitizer when soap and water are not available. Cough or sneeze into your sleeve and keep six feet between yourself and others. When you can't keep that six feet distance, use a cloth face covering in accordance with CDC recommendations. So keep your questions and myths coming. We're here to support you, and I wanna answer all those questions that you might be wondering about, but you're not really sure what the true answer might be about coronavirus. So keep calm and keep informed.